so you may have noticed I have not been uploading very often at all lately. And that's because until recently I have been spending a lot of my time here. Or here. 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 Here twice. Or here. Yeah. Spoiler alert, I'm a bit younger than most of you thought. Most of the time I've been spending on these rubber ovals of despair I've spent with these people, half of whom I hadn't even met till just over a year ago. But we quickly became friends with friendships forged in the fires of well, all wishing we were dead. We would show up every day of every week for months. We would go until our lungs were on fire, our legs were jello, and we just wanted to curl up on the turf and sleep. And then we would go again. And again. All for what? Well, for this. For that vision we've had since the beginning of the year, to stand on the wooden box in front of way too many people and smile. Because wow, we finally did it. And sure, there were ups and downs and lots of memes, there were scrapes and bruises and heartbreaking losses, but at the end, could I look back at it and smile? Yes. Yes, I could. It all becomes worth it when you cross that finish line with a sizable lead, when you're running anchor on the last event of the night, when it's dark, the lights are on, and it's so loud, all you can hear is the roar of the crowd and the sound of your own breath. Let's go, Silas, Let's finish strong! When it's you versus him in an all-out contest to see who's tougher, who's going to stick, and who's going to quit. And then you come out knowing you're tougher. When everyone's mom needs a hundred pictures, so you stand there in the cold, covered in sweat, and smile for what feels like the thousandth photo. My main events this year were the 800, 4x800, and 4x400. The 800 is generally recognized as the most painful event. It's a ridiculously long sprint. At least if you want to win, it is. And I wanted to win. When describing the difference between a good 800 runner and a bad one, I would always say it's the one who's the best at feeling like the one to die and pushing on anyway. A teammate once asked me how to run a faster 800 and I told them this. Run a 600 as fast as you can. Run until you have nothing left. Take that last curve and pass as many people as possible. And then, on that very last straight, grit your teeth and freaking run. At this point, I'm generally blacking out and have tunnel vision on the finish line. My legs have nothing left to give and I'm forcing myself to sprint on sheer willpower alone. When you're in pain, when you're putting all that hard work to use, then you're giving all you have to give and then it pays off, that's when you know what it is to succeed. Something that most people can never truly say they felt. Can you?